I share my meditation with you all that is cooking, makeup, product reviews, DIYs and traveling and so much more I'm going to share. Without any further delay, I am going to give a product review today which is of two most popular brands that is Pons and Garnier. So you already have seen I have these two micellar waters in my hand and I am going to review these two products. So let's get started. So this is a uh, Pond's Vitamin Micellar Water. This is a variant of Brightening Roses, which is basically rose water uh, variant. And it has got three variants. Oh, so one is, I have already told you, Brightening Rose. The other is Charcoal. And the third one is Aloe Vera. So this one is uh, Rose Water. And also, again, Pure Garnier is also the pink version. They call it as pink version. So Pond's, uh, Pond's is basically the first and most important thing about Pons is the, the product inside it is made in India and it's quite a good product which you will get to know in the end what kind of a product and what differences are there between them. It says that it is a waterproof makeup remover. The second thing is non-alcoholic and the third thing is no fragrance and five times brightening roses. So this is the four things it claims. Uh, that is what I feel is somehow not true because it has got a very strong smell. Uh, it has got a very strong fragrance. Whenever you apply, you can just smell that rosy kind of uh, rose water kind of uh, fragrance is there while you are using it. And the second thing which it claims, which I have already tested that if you have any waterproof makeup, you can just apply, it won't remove it. I have tried it two, three times and even after that, using it for two, three times, it, was, it didn't came out. So I was using this Maybelline mascara which is my favorite and i try to remove it every time i try to remove even after putting the cotton dab for so long which was futile to me because two of the things uh, which i don't feel is uh, true uh, that it is not fragrance free and the other thing does not remove your waterproof makeup about Pons is uh, I am going to tell you basic ingredients it has got so this has got niacinamide which is basically a uh, acid uh, which helps in uh, reducing the inflammation and any irritation on your face so it helps uh, to reduce the irritation on your face which is really good for sensitive skin vitamin A B5 B3 C and E vitamin A basically has its healing properties and brightening effect on your face vitamin B3 is for lightening spots uh, if you have an acne uh, spots on your face so it will help you to brighten that. vitamin c helps you from damaging your free radicals which are uh, caused by the uv rays as you all know sun exposure is the biggest enemy for our skin vitamin b keeps our skin hydrated and again vitamin e is one and the same thing like niacinamide it helps to reduce that irritation and inflammation on your face so these all ingredients are superb and uh, what i like the most about pons is first i've already told you because uh, it is made in india and the second most important thing is they have showed and displayed all of their ingredients which i think is customer has the right to know all the ingredients what he is applying he or she is applying on his face i doubt that uh, garnier does not display much of its ingredients on the packaging because as a customer we always expect the transparency between the, the brands and the customer and it's almost the same the statement that it claims that it removes all of your makeup from your face which uh, i felt is a flawed statement for me because it does not do that to your face if you are a person who is regularly using a lighter makeup or maybe you are using uh, two or three products on your face this micellar water is really great for you because it helps to remove dirt and actually um, a light makeup from your face but it does not remove that heavy makeup or heavy waist i I don't uh, recommend you to use these micellar waters on heavy basis. This was all about Pons. So on the other hand, in short, I will explain the Garnier. This is basically the first thing I have read it. And these days I am reading on the packaging is this is made in China. Let's start with the packaging. So packaging is almost same uh, difference is their shapes, but their caps are already uh, i have told you that they are really disappointing and the other thing is i have told you that garnier does not its actual ingredients it has the same kind of ingredients what has been used in the micellar water which is being made by pond so they are one and the same but if you count on the basis of visibility of the ingredients ponds 
win the game by displaying all of its ingredients on the packaging itself. The price is, uh, Pons is cheaper than Garnier. So this is 125 ml of bottle and I bought it for 175 rupees. And this one is uh, 250 ml of water which I bought for two, uh, 2 double line which was on discount these both were on discount but I feel uh, if you calculate then uh, you will find that Garnier is expensive than Pons uh, the third thing what it claims it contains no alcohol no fragrance it is non oily non sticky and the dermatologically tested so what I feel I don't feel any alcohol it does not make my skin dry as you all know alcohol makes our skin dry and uh, creates an irritation on your face so it does not do that to your face it does not have that strong fragrance so i don't feel uh, these two claims were totally right uh, this has got one more version that is oil infused which i have not used it but i have used it and i think i will not be going to use it again because this is quite expensive and ponds and garnier works the same the only difference is uh, it does not contain fragrance which uh, on the other hand ponds has got a strong fragrance in it uh, i have tried removing water uh, waterproof makeup also it did not came out so both of this micellar water if so if you're confused uh, which one is better and which one uh, we should go for it so i would say both of them works the same for it so i would suggest you if you're in, in true indian then you should definitely go for ponds because this is made in india and i love my country and i want to use everything which is made in india so thank you so much for watching this video my product reviews and do share me your experience with all the micellar waters or all the makeup removals that you use after your makeup if you like this video don't forget to subscribe like and share and tell me your experience with the micellar water or makeup removers in the comment section box and click on the bell icon to get all the updates from my channel cocoon deals by shelja bye bye